Welcome back. Today I will introduce the drawing of the center line of the lane and along the roadside. There are two methods, semi-automatic detection and manual drawing. First of all, draw the center line of the lane. Here we need to prepare two lane lines in the lane line layer in advance. After clicking to generate the center line of the lane, we click the left lane line and the right lane line in turn. The lane center line can be generated and it will be stored in the corresponding lane center line layer. Next, to draw manually, click the lane center line, click the starting point of the point cloud, move the mouse and click the nodes in turn. The shortcut keys here are the same as the lane line drawing. Double click the left mouse button to end the drawing. Generate lane center lines. Click to select and then click this line to view it. The same line also exists in the layer of our lane center line. Then the semi-automated detection drawing along the roadside. Click to draw along the roadside, and the setting dialog window will pop up. The parameter setting of this function mainly includes the following points. Arc step length. The curb may have a large arc. Adjust the step length to make the arc part fit in the actual point cloud. It is recommended to be less than 0.3 meters and less than 0.1 meters. Minimum curb height. If the actual curb is lower than the set value, it cannot be detected. It is recommended to select the distance between the click and the actual rope curb point cloud, which is more than 0.1 meters and within 0.5 meters. We can freely combine curb position and line position, left and right, or up and down, etc. Click to select the starting point along the roadside and its growth direction to start automatic roadside detection. After the detection is completed, press the enter key to generate the roadside line. The shortcut key operation here is the same as that of the lane line drawing. The vector line also exists in the corresponding layer along the roadside. Click to select and then click on this line to view some of its properties. Next, draw the roadside line manually. Click the roadside line to draw. Click the starting point in the point cloud. Move the mouse to click one by one. Double click the left button to end the drawing. Click to select and then click this line to view it. It also exists in the corresponding layer alongside the roadside. This is the end of this video for the drawing explanation of the center line of the lane and the line along the roadside. Thank you for watching.